What is up, guys? Super Plush Boo here, and today I decided that I'd give you guys my thoughts on the recent Final Fantasy Friday Secure Breach gameplay trailer. Um, I do. I I know that this trailer came out like um, like three weeks ago. I don't know how long ago it was. It was around the end of um, October when it came out. So yeah, I know I'm kind of late on this, but. I mean, a lot of people have done their uh, theories their theories on it, and I thought, why well, I just give you guys my thoughts on it. So, yeah, so today I'm just going to give you guys my thoughts and maybe my, some of my theories on what I think is going to happen throughout a security breach. And so, yeah, so let's just quickly here, let's just jump into it. So right here, we just, as you can see right here, it just says, may, may contain content inappropriate for children. Uh, Yeah, that, yeah, you see what that says. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> So as you can see there, we were at the start of the last trailer. Because if you guys remember at the uh, last gameplay trailer that I think came out in February, we had that cutscene at the end where Vanny peeks out. So if I if I go back, if I go back, if I go back, yeah, right here, you see we're at the end of the previous trailer. I'm trapped. And as you can hear, you heard someone say, we're trapped. So if I had to take a guess... That is probably Gregory saying that we're trapped in the big mega pizza plex. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for visiting, and we hope you enjoyed the show. Freddy and the gang are pretty tired, but they'll be back again next week after a few days of scheduled maintenance. So, as you were able to hear there, our old friend is back after him coming... After he was introduced in this location, and ever since this location, he was he was a voice ever since. So our good old friend is back. Our good old announced friend is back. So yeah, we hear him saying that that are thanking people for visiting the Pizza Plex and hoping that they enjoyed the Glamrock animatronics doing their show. Hope they enjoyed the Glamrocks performing. And you also heard him say that Fred and the gang were pretty tired. And then they'll come back next week after a few days of scheduled maintenance. And as we, if I go back, as you can see, we have some very cool shots of Glamour Chica. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for visiting, and we hope you enjoyed the show. Freddy and the gang are pretty tired, but... Now what makes this interesting is that if you look on this picture, she looks like she is eating something. Because if we could see here... Be back yeah, you saw right there, something flew out of her hand. We can't really see what that is. Uh, it could be a pepperoni from a pepperoni pizza. Um, it could be. Or, well, I'm not going to go down that deep, but um, it could be just pizza. We don't know what that is, but she definitely is feasting on something here. We don't know what it is, but she's definitely on something. She's eating something right now. Next week, after a few days of schedule. And right here, we're gonna we're gonna get a good shot of Glamour Chica, and it looks like this is gonna be her jumping towards us. Maintenance. So I can see she just leaps up towards us, and I can see we kind of like pull away a little bit because we think that she was gonna come attack her. As you can see, there's the watch. You guys can see the watch there. And as you can see right here, Freddy Fazbear. As you can see right here, Chica is crushed. So, if I go back a little bit, it looks like it was a crushing machine that did that. Yeah, if you can see right there, it looked like it was a crush machine. If I go back. Maintenance. You can see the machine went down. As you can see, it's slowly rising up. Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizza. So, as you can see, that was a crushing machine that looked like um, that crushed Chica. And also, I'm probably going to wonder myself, who is there someone that made, like, like... How did the crushing machine go? Like, did somebody trigger that or what? So now we're going to listen to our famous announcer again. Next week, after a few here. days of scheduled maintenance. So now we're going to listen to him real quick here and listen to what he says. So listen to what our good old friend says. Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizza Plex is now closed, initiating nighttime protocols. So he says that the Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizza Plex is not closed. And he also says, what was else that he said? Access now closed. Initiating nighttime protocol. Initiating nighttime protocols. So I guess that means that they're shutting the place down. 
and they're put on some type of night mode from what it looks like. Now, as we see here, looking at the scenery, Pizza Flex is. This was something we saw in those, um, those images, those teaser images that we got a while back. Uh, as you can see, as you can see, we have Bonnie Bull. You can see that that's up there. So we definitely know we can definitely confirm that Bonnie Bull is going to be a place here. You can see the sign what it looks like Roxanne's Raceway. You can see the purple logo for Phaser Blast. As you can see, there's a prize section up there. And this and as you can see, there's a lot of stuff here. Like there's a what it looks like it says El Chips. Um, I don't know what this is over here. Uh, as you can see, there's Monty's Gator Golf. There's something up there. We don't know. We can't really fully read what that says. Oh, uh, we can't fully read what that says. Um, we keep Protocol. moving. Uh, let's listen real quick to what we hear first. No, no, wait, I'm still here. So that must have been Gregory. Let, trying to yell out that he's still in there, trying to let them know that he's still in there, but he was too late. The doors were automatically shut. So real quick here, let's take a look back at what we saw here. No, no, wait. Okay, let's Okay. So here, okay. So there's the Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizza Plus logo, Pizza Plex logo up there. That's the good old fashioned logo. I really like that logo. No. Okay. Here is what I like. As you can see on the floor, there's a big giant uh, looking version of the logo that says Freddy Faster's Mega Pizza Plex. And to be honest, this right here looks like a mall. Like the floor looks like, like a mall floor. And as you can see, we have on the left and right two small uh, the of the robots, the help bots. And as you can see, Gregory's holding his flashlight. And then we got the big giant stage now if we looked at if we saw in the image it looked like it was just a normal size stage but in this case it's a big stage with holograms of the characters performing now what's new what's what makes this cool is that if you look closely if you look closely right here you can see that the actual glamrock freddy is standing right there by the hologram of the hologram freddy's uh leg you can see he's right you can barely see him but you can see he's right there where the glam rock freddy hologram is now, as you see we got uh, uh holograms of freddy roxanne chica and monty now we've seen a hologram of monty before in the uh, monty's gator golf so we might see two holograms of monty in um monty's gator golf in here and there might be a roxanne hologram in uh, roxanne's race course possibly so I think if I remember in Roxy's race course, we saw like a golden statue of her. So maybe there also be a hologram. Wait, I'm still here. Now, as you can see, we have another good shot of, uh, this is our first look on this trailer of the Night Guard, which you could definitely tell that this is a new model compared to the previous model. I think this model looks better. Um, this def it definitely looks more um, accurate to her design like this definitely looks more like this model of her looks more accurate than the previous one as you see she's got a big flashlight uh this part right here just this looks like it's a cutscene, and this probably looks like this is when she finds us okay let's keep playing and look at this right here i'm gonna play this for you guys real quick just watch it. okay you guys saw that i'm gonna go back so you guys can see a little bit of that as you guys were able to see, we saw that Glamour Chica is alive. So, after we crushed her, she didn't move. So, so we might think that, okay, we crushed her. We defeated Glamour Chica. Yay, we're good. We don't have to worry about Glamour Chica anymore. But, really, we're not. Because, as you can see... She opens her eyes, and this is what she does. She comes attacking us. So, yeah. So we might have thought at first that Glamour Chica was dead. You know, guy with the bloom. She comes back to life. She gets activated and comes jumping for us. Now let's watch this next part here. I'm going to listen. I want you guys to listen to it, and then I'll tell you guys what I think. I warned you! I you! So as you see, we have a shot of 
what is the Sun Hamatronic, and he has a voice. Now, this is something I think a lot of people said too, but this voice to me sounds like the guy who voiced it Funtime Freddy's voice. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think this is the same guy who voices Funtime Freddy? Because that's what I think it sounds like. And he says... He says, lights on, lights on. I think that's what he said. Lights on, I want you. I want you. That's what he said. So, I guess when it's dark out, he gets triggered or something. I'm not sure, because he falls. Lights on! I want you! I want you! Okay, and here's a mechanic. As he says, press square to push over cans. So, we push over cans. And as you're able to see right there, Glamour Chica... Glamour Chica is distracted by this can, so she's going the other way. Um, I don't know where this is. This looks like it's in a bathroom. It looks like we're in a bathroom, right? And here we got this shot of Vanny skipping down the stairs. And this here looks like it's in the main lobby. You know, like from when the first um, Secure trailer came out, we're in that main lobby. You know where the giant Golden Glamour Freddy statue's at? That's where this looks like it's at. We got Vanny coming down here. And now we're back in the same area, except we get to say hello to a new friend. As you can see, we got to say hello to Moondrop. And this we're back in the same area. So sun sunrise falls and Moondrop rises. So we can now confirm that Moondrop and Sunrise aren't separate characters. It's one character that turns into a different type of form. So when it's when the lights are on, it's a sunrise animatronic, but when the lights are off, it turns into a moon drop. So I think from what it looks like, sunrise is a good one, and moon drop is the bad guy. And you heard him say, naughty boy. We don't know what that means, so yeah. Now as you can see here, we have another shot of Glamour Chica. Hunting this down. I don't know what's with Glamour Chica in this trailer, but it seems like Glamour Chica is going to be a big threat in uh, Fight to First Secure Ridge. So this looks like we're in like some type of like um, locker room because there's lockers back there. There's shower curtains. That's what this looks like. So yeah, there's going to be at least probably twelve thousand rooms in this uh, pizza plex because we've already seen like almost at least thirty rooms already. And I'm not going to count, I'm not going to give you guys all the rooms, because you guys can probably already know what all the rooms are, looking at all the teasers we've been getting. So yeah, as you see, we got Gregor's flashlight, we got Glamour Chica coming for us, like I said. Um, we look like we're in a locker room, and now we might think right here, right here, we're going to think, what are we going to do? Glamour Chica's after us, how are we going to get away? Well, we have a solution right now. Right here is our solution. Now... I want you guys to know, a lot of people have been thinking, is Glamour Cove, is it all going to, is it going to be all the m that are going to be nice towards us? Is it just going to be one of them? Are they all going to hunt us down? The previous trailer, I thought that it was going to be all of them hunting us down, because we saw that they all had red eyes. In this case, no. Only one out of four are nice towards us, and that is the main mascot, Glamour Freddy. Don't you guys worry. I promise you guys right now, looking at this trailer, that Glamour Freddy will be the nice one in here he's the only good guy i think sunrise is also gonna be good but i think when it's dark he's gonna be not good he's gonna be a bad guy so from what it looks like glamrock freddy and possibly the night guard are the only two good ones in this game so i can see freddy's chest is open and what makes this unique is we are gonna be we jump into his chest As you can see it shuts and we play as him so as you can see here, let's look at this. So as you can see here, as you can see up there, it says exit press. So if we press a button on our controller, we're going to get out of his chest. And as you can see, there are, we can look at the watch while we're in his chest with the triangle. And if you look right there, if you look down at the bottom in the middle, there is a battery. So from what it looks like, Glamrock Freddy has battery. So he only has a certain amount of power until he powers off. So let's see. And as you can see, Glamour Chica does not see us. Um, Glamour Chica thinks that it's just Glamour Freddy roaming around trying to... Well, you see, I think that the others that are hunting us down think that Freddy is also trying to hunt us down. But actually, he's not. He's trying to help us out. 
So as you can see, Glamour Chica does not see us. He, she sees Glamour Freddy, but she thinks that Freddy's trying to help the animatronics out and hunting Gregory down, but he's not. And as you see, we're in an office. As you can see, there what it looks like it's a charge station. As you see, there is a door. I, if we'll talk about this Freddy thing over here. As you see, we say hold square to recharge flashlight. So that looks like a recharge station for our flashlight. As you can see, there was a door. Now, if you're familiar with this office, guys. If you guys know, which I know I probably haven't talked about a lot on my channel. But this right here looks like the office. Well, the table, the big screen monitor. That looks like the um, desk office from the... What I think was the um, Secure Breach uh, website. You know, with the big screen and the little other monitors and the button. Yeah, that. That's what this looks like. And it looks like it's literally that. Now, it looks like that there's there's an office. So, yeah, it looks like this is going to be a safe spot. So, we might think that we're going to be fine because it's an office. But, well, let's just say that it doesn't look like we're going to have a lot of break times in this game. Because, since we're in an office, which is a safe spot... That doesn't mean we're going to be fully safe. Because if I keep playing this. Glamour Chica is after us again. And she is hunting us down. And it looks like right here is the part where I think because we're in a corner. We are going to get jump scared. I do want to see what their jump scares are. I'm really interested. We saw one jump scare in the first Secure Beast trailer. That was Vanny's. But we don't know if that's a full on jump scare. Now if we look to the right you can see there is that Freddy thing again. To me, I think that is the charge station for Glamrock Freddy, where we have to charge him. Not our flashlight, we have to charge him. That's what that over there looks like. And as you can see, there's an exit, what looks like an exit sign behind her. So yeah, let's go ahead. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play this for you real quick, because there's going to a, be a voice that we're listening to. So I'm going to play that first. I'm going to place the voice first, and then I'm going to tell you guys. So here, let's listen first. You should be able to escape when the security doors reopen at 6 a.m. So right there, you heard a voice saying you should be able to escape when the doors open at 6 a.m. To me, I think that is Freddy speaking because I don't think it's Monty. I don't think it's the sun or moon animatronic. I think that's Freddy. I don't think that is Monty because I think we already know what Monty might sound like when we saw the other gameplay trailer where he has that deep, angry voice. So yeah, we think that this is Freddy talking. Um, if I go back, as you can see, we have the camera system, which we're going to talk all about this soon, but let's keep playing. Able to escape when the security doors reopen at 6 a.m. Until then, keep moving and try not to draw attention to yourself. So he says, keep moving, try not to draw attention to yourself. So it looks like we're going to be keep, we're gonna have to keep moving throughout the big pizza plex, and we're going to have to try not to draw attention to ourselves. So we just got to be precautious. And as you can see right here, we have what looks like it's the main entrance and the main lobby. Now, if you look down here, it's a bar of like how much sprint juice we have. And looking at this uh, gay play footage right here, it looks like it really drains. Try not to draw attention to yourself. If there is another. Yeah, it looks like it drains re really, really fast. So it looks like we might not have that much sprint energy. because It really drains. And as you can see, we're definitely in the main lobby and you know we're gonna keep playing. out i will help you find it i promise and he says if he finds another exit he will i will help you i promise so you could tell right here that glamour credit is a good guy and he will help us now let's rewind back and talk about some of the stuff here that we see you should be able to so here is a camera. Here is what the cameras in our watch look like. Now we've seen something like this in the gameplay trail when we were in Monty's Gator Golf Course. As you can see, we got cameras, maps, missions, and messages. So as you can see, cameras. Now there is another office right there, what it looks like. So there might, there might be multi-offices. So there might be different offices we might be able to go to. And as you can see, we got Monty and Roxanne hunting us down. As you can see, we got maps. We got map. So maybe that's going to be like a map of the entire place. 
Missions. That's a g- good one because what I think about missions is I think that there's got to be multitask or have to do while we're in the pizza place. Kind of like in Bendy and the Ink Machine where we have to do all these different things. That's what I think it's going to be. I think this game's going to be kind of like Bendy the Ink Machine where we're going to have to do different tasks. Because like in Bendy the Ink Machine, we were in this big giant studio and we had to do multitask in there. That's why I feel like this is going to be like. And then we got messages. So we're probably going to get maybe get messages from uh, this Night Guard and maybe Glamour Freddy possibly and as you see down here the camera system we got an arrow which looks like that's probably where we are and we got two different like red boxes i can't zoom in down there but we got like two different red boxes down there um those could be where these animatronics are at that could be the case um so yeah and we got this little 1.0 x thing down here that's probably like a zoom in and out thing and as you see, we got a good, good shot of Monty, and it looks like he's on, like, some type of ride. The doors reopen at 6 a.m. So as you see, he was, like, hang, he's right on, like, some type of hang ride. And he jumps down, like, this bridge. And this definitely looks like it's in Gator Golf, because you see some palm trees back there. So, yeah. This looks like it's in Gator Golf. Monty Gator Golf. Now, here we got another shot of some cameras. So as you see, we got cameras, maps, missions, messages. Um, yeah, this arrow is definitely where we are, because you can see us... In the window and you can see monty here is bashing on the door trying to break in keep moving and try not to drop okay here's another shot so yeah like we can scroll we can hit the scroll thing and it'll scroll us around and if we got glamour chica hunting us down so this looks like he's in the same area but except this time we got glamour chica it looks like it's in top of the hallway i don't know where this is at in the mall it could possibly be in like in a lower ground level like an underground level. I don't know about the underground. But yeah. Attention to your... Okay, we already talked... You can see the Pizza Plex logo on the left. And you can see... If you look here on like... On these parts of the walls. So you can see the old, old teaser images. From the very first. Like back in 2019 when we got these teaser images. Like Glamour Freddy Rock. Uh, I think it was... Ro that's Roxanne that said... Uh, what was Roxanne's dance in a Monty's Jam? I'm sure Glamour Chicas is over there that says party. So you guys remember those images, the first, like, actual images we got. gotten. Okay, now we got one other thing we're going to talk about. If there is another way out, I will help. We need to talk about this thing right here. Yeah. A lot of people have been talking about this thing right here. And a lot of people have been having reactions about this creature right here. They brought back Music Man. This big, horrifying character. And what makes this thing horrifying is this thing, this thing looks huge looking. This looks like it's almost 30 feet tall. That's what this looks like. And I can see, you can see there's a Garcade game that's got what looks like the Charlie doll and the Theodore doll. That's what that looks like. Or no, it's not Charlie. It's like the, what was it? The Isabel doll, I think that's what it was. Yeah, that's what it looks like over there. Yeah, look at this thing. You can see Music Man. He's got headphones on. Look how small the hat is. He's got... Um, this design of Music Man looks a little different than the one in uh, Pizza Race Simulator. A little different. Now, this definitely looks like it's in this warehouse from the first trailer. This looks like it's in that warehouse. You can see there's lockers. There's a truck. Find it. Now, if I go back real quick there, you can see there's a... A Fred Bear with cheeseburgers. Yeah, do you see that? You see that right there? Fred Bear and some cheeseburgers? Yeah, there's a car right there, but yeah, you see that? Fred Bear and cheeseburgers. So maybe it's a game of Fred Bear and cheeseburgers. Maybe that's the case. And here's another shot, and as you see, we're gonna go past Glamour Chica. Like we said, we can check the watch, get out Freddy's chest, and we can see how much battery he has left, and we're gonna go past Glamour Chica. Okay. Now we are here meeting all the Glamour animatronics. Look at this. That is cool. Now something I want to point out before I continue, because I'm going to play through the whole thing. Um, if you notice, you can see that it looks like some type of shock comes out of Glamour Freddy's chest. I promise. I'll show you. So you can see the lightning. And you can see how his, um, the lightning bolt on his chest glows. So, are we going to be able to shock through Glamrock Freddy's chest? Or is he going to be able to, like, 
or what? Because you could see how it's like it shocked out of his chest and his lightning bolt lighted up. You could see that. Yeah, you saw that? But yeah, the scenery here looks really good. This looks like it's the main, another main entrance area. As you can see a good picture of them over there on that side. Got Freddy over there, Roxanne, Monty Gator, and Glamour Chica. And you got them all right here. You got Glamour Chica on the far left, Mo Freddy, Monty, and the Roxanne on the far right. But yeah, I'm just going to play through all this real quick, all right? Uh, actually, no, we're going we're gonna to quickly take a look at this. Right here. Here we got and, Wolf. and then right here, we got Roxanne chasing us, and watch this. This is what we can do. We can shock the animatronics, and it looks like the shocks the uh, help bots too. That's what it looks like. That. And here, we're in like some type of trash section. We look like we're in some type of underground place in like this trash section. And you remember that scrapped version of uh, Glamour Cheek we saw? That's what this is right here. That's what this is. Now, she's hunting us down. Yep. And here we got a, This is a good shot right here of the Pizza Plex logo. That is. I just love this logo so much. And as we are. As we get a good shot of that. We get a good shot of Montgomery Gator. And this is a cool shot of Montgomery Gator. Watch what he does on here. He is bashing on a gun. Yeah. If I go back more. Oh no, just more. Back on his gun. Yeah, this is why I probably feel like he's an angry dude, cause he bashed on this gun, and you can see there's dents in it. I don't know if those are dents in the gun or not, but yeah, y you get you get the point. And then we got Freddy, back. and as you see right here in this shot, his he glitched a little bit. And as you can see right here, he falls. You can see it says detected and his microphone falls. Yeah. So maybe this is when we're in Freddy's chest and his battery goes low. That could be the case. Or Vanny finds us and he. Vanny possesses a Glamour Freddy. We'll have to see. But I'm going to go back and I'm going to play all that for you real quick just so you guys can watch it. So let me go back. Alright, you guys can watch it. <laughs> Make your way to the front of the building where you will be given okay so right there real quickly we have a good shot of all the glamour glamour tracks rising up on stage singing getting ready to play their music make your way to the front of the building we got this good shot here glamour chica where you will be given and here we get this good shot of vanny literally doing her little skip skip down the hallway and every time I look at Vanny doing the skip, it just reminds me of how one of we glitched up did like that dance thing where he waves his arms. That's what just what it reminds me of. Glasses, a voucher for one free soda refill, watch, and where you will sign a like legal disclaimer, sway releasing thing. us of all liability for anything that might have happened during your visit. Have an all yeah, that's a cool shot. And real quick here, we just gotta listen to what um our good old announcer says. Please make your way to the front of the building, where you will be given novelty glasses, a voucher for one free soda refill, and where you will sign a legal disclaimer releasing us of all liability for anything that might have happened during your visit. Have an awesome night, and we'll see you again soon. Okay, this right here I want to talk about, because it looks like these are the help bots. And you know what's funny about these is that these don't look happy. They look mean. Um, the thing with these help bots here is that you can see on their chest, they all have a writing that says, In Your Dreams. 
And, you know, we still haven't had the theory on who that creature is at the end of the previous game play trail where their hand just comes out. We still haven't had a theory on who that could be. Um, it could be these guys, but it doesn't look like it could be these guys. Um, it could be the the the, guy, the hand could be glitch trap or spring traps. It could be either one. But yeah, these guys look terrifying, and they kind of look like the puppet a little bit because you got they got the the stripes down their eyes and they got like that kind of like the mouth shape. They kind of look like the puppet a little bit, but they are definitely the help bots. Would you like to take a short survey about your experience? And as you can see right here. This right here is the release date, December 16th, 2021. Yeah, we are pretty close. So, if we go back real quick here, I just want to... Let's just see, if we go back real quick, I just kind of want to give you guys my full thought here about looking at Monty here smashing his gun. So as you can see here, we got this gun, what it looks like here. This looks like it's a gun that shoots golf balls. I think that's what it looks like. Now, as you can see, we can watch Monty literally beat the living crap out of it, and he dents it. Just watch. And you see sparks comes out. Nothing shoots out from what it looks like. Steam comes up. And look at all the... Look at how dently bad... Look how badly dent he, he made that thing. He really smashed that. So, I think looking at this right here, I can definitely confirm that Monty is going to be a very, very aggressive animatronic. You know, just judging from looking at the past um, uh, teasers we got of him, you know, in the uh, gameplay trailer, how we hear, we hear this aggressive voice. And then in the images, where we see his green room, are completely destroyed. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, um, you... you if you guys don't know what I'm to go if you guys find those images and you look at his room, you'll talk you'll see what I'm talking about. Um Yeah. If you guys remember in that trip in that uh the uh, that picture of his green room, I fat remember his wall was cracked on the side of his, uh, the other wall by the door, there were claw marks and his cast was flipped. And one of his lights was well, his lights were out. But yeah. I think Monty in this game is gonna be a very very aggressive dude but yeah so we get this good shot of annie i really like the shot of Annie. i think this is like the first time getting a full-on look of her if you know what i mean so yeah that that is my thoughts on security breach um it definitely does look like we're gonna be going through one whole night of it, it doesn't look like we're gonna do like multi-nights it's definitely gonna be one whole night but it's going to be like, i probably say it's going to be like, it's going to definitely go for a while. So, yeah. So, yeah, guys. So, that is it. Um, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Uh, for right now, expect some of the Squid Game videos and the FNAF Security Dream videos. Because I want to make sure you guys see all these dream games, these Fight to Free Security Dream games before the actual Secure Breach comes out. Because if you guys want to see those videos, make sure you guys hit the bell and subscribe and hit the like button. And yeah, guys, don't worry. There will be a Thanksgiving special as well. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell, comment down below. Um, let me know what you guys' thoughts on the trailer. Um, if you guys want to see the trailer, there will be a little card at the top of the video screen. You can hit that. It will take you to the trailer. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next video.